here is something I don't know about me anymore. I don't know if I'm questioning a lot of things I'm thinking. I'm worried after the impact. You can't tell anymore. But I hit my head pretty hard. There's a scrape here too, big scab there. I jumped out of a car because I wanted them to feel bad for me. And no, I wasn't lying. And no, that I, no, I didn't actually steal a whole bunch of money from you. You're, I don't owe you everything for, sorry, 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 sorry. I owe you my everything, everything. Everything I ever had in any way ever. Wish I could get it back and give it to you. All of it. And I will. Because I'm going to work. I'm going to come off ODSP. I'm going to have a full-time job. Part-time job. Come off of the ODSP. They're being nice enough to give me capacity to consent. They're not making me talk to no one. Like, the way it's driving me mental. They're taking me seriously. I guess I've gotten lucky with doctors. I better get out of here before they change my doctor. Um, may have been offered a room. I'm going to take it. Even if I, you know, have to be polite about it. You know what I mean? I'll take the room. Uh, just for two months. And uh, I just wanted to say, if you want to be a good feminist, here's what you got to do. You praise men who are good. You say, oh my God, the self-control it must take. Oh my God, the self-control it must take. And then you say, thank you if you happen to understand that it is not fucking logical that a female goes to a doctor to get her tubes tied like I have twice and told, no, we're not doing that for you. You're not old enough. Yeah, a man can get his fucking thing tied. And they're like, good for you, man. That's fucked up. And if you know that, you're a feminist. Just that's the way it is. And so what if you don't do or don't believe in abortion? That doesn't make you not or not. It's just, it's like, it's just, with things the way they are, don't tell a woman, like, you should have kept your legs shut if everyone's trying to pry them open and stuff. You know, and then I was outside, I was smoking a cigarette, and the speaker said, thanks for not smoking. I like clean air. Stop driving cars. Or get your testicles snipped. You're not snipped off. I'm not saying genital mutilation. And when you talk about genital mutilation, foreskin is not the head of your penis. Female genital mutilation is like you no longer are a person. You're a robot for anyone. So... Anyway, this is all true. The uh, uh, at war with an algorithm, algorithm at war with an algorithm, Dad. If you want to do something with not just sell your soul to whoever's fucking manipulating nature to make it do some miraculous thing, people gen genetics are self healing. It's self healing. Watch Greg Braden. He's my real dad. <laughs> I know that sounds ridiculous, but he is. I, I think he's he's more like my my dad than I would ever want you to. You look like. You look alike, therefore it's much more easy to accept him as my dad. You know what I mean? I'm Paige now. My name is Paige. And maybe uh, zero population growth will hire me. Or just, you know, um, just, I don't care. I don't think they make a lot of money. I don't, anyone would, would, would donate to zero population growth. Who God knows what they're doing. I don't believe in anything but passive activism. But I think uh, a lot of paintings I have in mind could really speak to people. Really fucking speak to people. Like a, like a male's model muscle ass and back and it's shitting out uh, chicken eggs with um, fetuses in them but then of course you have to devalue the female on the other side of the canvas like some fat welfare person uh, paying for food with a fetus something disgusting and I know that's not a nice painting but I'm Dali I was born a day and a month after he died so, of course, I would believe that I'm Dali. And I know that's not even true anyway. I don't believe in things in that way. I think if you identify with something, yeah, you can change your DNA and your motivations to become what they are. And I did learn painting from Dali and space photography. NGC 6357A is the mountain, woman, womb, reaching, shielding her face, pointing up, and the mountain climber on the side also looks like the sand castle the blueprint sand castle that they all do they dig 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 and then the brother or the sister makes the tunnel the moat everyone has a job and that is the sand castle it is the womb it is the same abstract form in ngc 6357a karina nebula keyhole figures the ape face and the creative block next to the ape face the dangling person the placenta falling from the dangling person, the hero, man, teaching her to fly or stealing her baby. Look at it whatever way you want. And the devil, one, or the punishment, one, where you are in the muck. Just your legs, only your legs and bum are there. 
and they're in the muck and they're trying to get away from the Sith like penetrating thing behind it chasing its heart it's up there in the Carina Nebula and Eagle Nebula an, a sprightly form catching arrows coming at the eagle and that's the Eagle Nebula so I'm vaping now to make sure the environment is really much better and it's good for me tastes like cream 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 so good so very good and that's all we're doing in here I'm turning it off um, so whatever I guess I'd paint some things if I had the chance I have big canvas money talk about it 50 bucks a big canvas that's a lot of money when you're living on pretty much 100 bucks a week but I have paints I have some brushes I do have some canvas and some blank ones they're not that big but I want to go big I have to go big now so I need a little office I have to make a trip back from my cousin's baby shower and I got lots of toys for them Flying squirrel. I'm going to have to stock up on that flying squirrel again. Get maybe I'll order five or ten flying squirrel. They're 20 bucks each. Folklore puppets all the way. Flying squirrel. Any age, get that kid. The flying squirrel is important. Um, I don't know. Oh, we were going to talk about children's media. Garfield Christmas special. Um, Bjork dancer in the dark. Um... Christmas comes but once a year Now it's here There is no Santa Claus What is that? We'll have to find out I'll post it in the links below The Christmas one That makes you cry Christmas comes but once a year Now it's here Now it's here Christmas comes but once a year La 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 Christmas comes but once a year Now it's here Now it's here Christmas comes but once a year There is no Santa Claus Something like that is beautiful. It's such a beautiful, beautiful show. There's one, there's just, what else did we watch? Garfield Christmas special. What was the other stuff? The Friendly Giant. The Friendly Giants. It's some old cartoon. It's not the BFG, it's the Friendly Giant. It's beautiful. It's about trusting an old man who's lonely and he's building toys or something. Um... Oh, there's some good Christmas there, in the children's media good old fashioned not ponies where you don't even know what's going on as long as it goes boom, boom, boom. then they're like woo they don't even look at the screen they don't even care they they're not watching that they're not watching it it's not interesting there's no story and if there was a story it's so quick that they wouldn't even know what's going on because they, they blinked a couple times you know so find the old-fashioned stuff or something new that's good. I don't know. Hey Arnold, I have that actually. I have the whole Hey, Ar hey Arnold complete set. I'm waiting and she wouldn't, she wouldn't let me give it to the cousin or whatever there was. Um, so whatever. Yeah, I'll give my cousin Hey Arnold. You know, that's a great, great show. Because um, it's about being cool and nice. He's like the cool one, the funky cool boy, but he's the nicest boy. <laughs> it's a good show. I'm not a nice person all the time, obviously. I'm fucking mad. I'm like gifted with, I'm telling you, that nebula, that's exactly what I prayed for. I was five years old the first time I prayed for that exact message to be in the stars. Five years old when I prayed for it. And I'm sure a lot of people were, pr pr women and men were praying for something like that, that would make sense and accent and, 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 and um, you know, uh, emphasize every emotion of the human soul. Dominance, submission, but the balance, the worship, the mountain, move the mountain. The way, the fact that the, the womb is a mountain, move the mountain. You don't move the mountain by telling it to move. And like, I mean, people say so. But the mountain moves because it loves what you're going to do. Do you know what I mean? That's why the mountain has nothing in it. It's just going, Ooh. that's how it feels when you become a participator, a participator in, in sexual things. You are aroused as well. It's not like, please have sex with me. Just let me. It's like, I actually enjoy you, your enjoyment. You know what I mean? It is, the message is in there. It's perfect. See, I have enthusiasm and I do have appreciation as so many people would understand that. So many poems were already written for it. A lot of people know about it. 
I'm not claiming to be shit. No one is shit. Everyone is shit. I'm Paige, okay? Um, 